Hey, love muffins. How's everybody doing this morning? I just came on. I got about an hour and a half to burn off before I have to be at work. So I want to um get some energy reads and see what we got going on in the air. Y'all give me one second. Hope everybody' day is going good so far. Mine so far so good. <laughs> and I've been up for a few hours, but um, I think I want to come back and make me some candles. And I think I got to make me another batch of body butter. I need some raspberry and some vanilla um scent oils. Day. I might have to get on Amazon, y'all. <laughs> And I hope I got the damn um, tin for the for the candles, but I think I do. I've been feeling my daddy energy a lot lately too. It's like every time I find diamonds in the floor, that's like his signal to let me know that he around. I don't know why he around. Usually when he come out, that means there's some bullshit going on. Because it's not often that you know. We'll see. That's never a good thing. <laughs> and then we got humor. I feel like we got somebody here that has a really airy, um, like, I don't want to say wild, but just like a very carefree spirit. Oh, yeah, I see this Buddha, someone that's like peaceful, but you know what I'm saying? They have a, um, a very healing energy. So we're going to see what come out with that job. Oh, shit. <laughs> that lasted for like 2.2 seconds we got adversity with that so somebody thinks that it is funny to cause challenges and um burdens in someone's life then we got loneliness in reverse to freedom okay so somebody may be coming out of hermit mode they may have done their um healing work with this freedom they realize that they have the power to 303 on the clock. They have the power to create their own happiness, their own um their own like happy space. Like they realize that their happiness is not tied to another person, place, or thing. So I feel like somebody got mental freedom, mental clarity. Somebody may be also realizing how powerful they are. This may be somebody that wasn't tapped into their spiritual gifts. But the two of swords, you might have blocked a lot of energies out. Give me something on this human in, in adversity. Like somebody's realizing the power of their mind, like they can literally change their, um, like they change their mindset and they realize that how, how more fruitful it, it made their life. Hmm. Okay. I can dig it. Oh boy. Somebody out here playing, y'all. So we got the humor, and then we got the hermit in reverse. My hermit in reverse to me is someone's ancestors in the underworld. So somebody doing something thinking it's funny. I'm telling you, they doing something thinking it's funny, but they don't realize that the person that they're causing all this adversity to has ancestors on the dark side, on the side that they playing on. Somebody is protected in the heavens and 
in the lower realm. And the adversity, like I can't make it up, adversity to the strength. They don't understand somebody's power. They thought that somebody may have thought that somebody was just um, blessed on the light side or protected on the light side. But you got somebody that's protected on the light side and the dark side, spiritually. And, and it's powerful to, with the strength card. Somebody better go sit down, man. <laughs> Somebody better go sit down. Yeah, this is me letting you know that you probably should go sit down. Because whatever you do is not going to work. Listen, Spirit, just move. Just stay alone. Just stay alone. Just move on. Ending of the world. Your world as you know it. People always get this... Um, and like... Somebody may be feeling freedom because they're no longer working with a group of people or you may have quit a job or you may be quitting a job. Oh, wow. To the six of wands. You feel like this is a victory? This may be um, a job that you didn't... This is a job that is not what you thought it was going to be. Damn. What? And we got a child from the loneliness. <laughs> Shit. It, it, this, is when, this is when the loneliness or being alone where you actually do the work on yourself spiritually and you tap into yourself spiritually and you draw to you your counterpart. Maybe. When you draw in your counterpart. See, so you must become what you seek. You want somebody that's trustworthy, you need to be trustworthy. You want somebody that's faithful, you need to be faithful. You want somebody that's loyal, you need to be loyal. Somebody became what they seek. And they drew their counterpart to them. Baby, once. <laughs> yeah, you got to be able to give what you're asking for. And somebody did that. Somebody did that. Damn, we got divine counterparts on the board early. Give me something on these. Listen, bound. <laughs> Listen, and stuck. I can't make it up. Whoever thought they was doing something funny, that somebody ancestors in the underworld got their ass hemmed the fuck up. Somebody ancestors got somebody hemmed the fuck up. Okay. That not confirmation. <laughs> I don't know what the hell that was, but I heard it. That's confirmation. Give me something on this strength card, spirit. Damn. They thought they was going to have somebody else tied up and stuck. Shit. They the only ones bound. I just seen that damn death card. Mm. Damn, a lot of Leo energy with this adversity. You got the strength to the Queen of Wands. We got this Queen of Wands in the upright. This could... Whoa. Yeah, whoever over here thought they was doing something funny to this Queen of Wands, baby, you ain't did nada. Everything that you tried was brought to a complete halt. And that heartbreak you thought you was finna give this woman, yeah, you getting all that. Yes, ma'am. This woman is divinely dead. Her ancestors not playing with none of y'all. Not. Damn, that was beautiful. Wow. So with this hyphen and this high priestess, it's like, A lot of people gonna think that this connection is about sex, 
they're going to think that it's about sex, but it's going to be like the way they communicate with each other, the knowledge that they're going to share between each other is and that's going to overpower the sex. These must be two people that look good as fuck. <laughs> because it's like, why would they assume that that assume that? Man, I wasn't even gonna pull that out. The lies someone spoke. They being judged by that shit in the underworld. <sighs> right away. Mm. Somebody really need to chill out, yo. What was they trying to do, spirit? Besides the lies. Man, death to the moon. Man, whatever you did, under, whatever you're trying to do under this moon, it's like somebody just need to stop. You already, like, caught the fuck up. Like, spiritually, you just, like, you in a horrible place spiritually and somebody just won't stop. So you got the death card, which is like, it will stop. And then you got the moon right after, which means you still like trying to cause challenges, but it's going just judgment immediately. Somebody need to just listen, just stop, stop. I mean, but shit, you got free will though. But just understand the risk that you take this risk that you're going to take out of anger. Listen, this person is protected. Protected. All realms. This person is powerful. Or oh, these people is powerful. I don't know why I feel like it's both of these people. Like the high priestess provides the protection in the spiritual realm. And then this hierophant, he provides protection in the 3D realm. Or the, well, shit, same shit. Or the underworld. Wow. That's powerful. That is powerful. And somebody over here playing with it. Somebody over here playing with it. They, they should go sit down. Listen to the Ten of Cups. Well, they ass is over here stuck. Mm. Damn. Yo, what the fuck? Mm. I don't know why I'm picking this up like, <laughs> oh my goodness, somebody getting a ride to hell, yo. <laughs> like somebody on the fast track to like, to like lower vibe, like to like being stuck in lower vibration. Yeah, confirmation. You know, what the hell that cat in there doing? Man, this, this, yeah, somebody is sealing their fate right here, and it ain't in a good way, and they think this shit is funny. This nigga need to go sit down, man. Her too. We ain't even... We gonna end this one right here, y'all. But somebody is definitely stealing their fate. Somebody is on the fast track to their soul being in the gutter. To their spirit being in the gutter. They spirit already in the gutter, though. They just didn't think that they would be judged on that realm because they feel like they was running shit. <laughs> somebody ain't running shit. Somebody, a somebody spirit team in the underworld is not playing with somebody. Mm.
That's somebody that's protected on all realms. On all dimensions. They high ranking. Mm. Listen, death. <laughs> Spirit say, don't let your spiritual insurance lapse. Damn. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> Man, you don't want to be out in this bitch uncovered. It's tragic. Uh, give me the next three spirit. Man, come on. I, I keep saying that I don't want to read these karmic energies, but evidently it is. Something that needs to be read on, man. I can't even. Somebody may feel like a failure. And you want someone to forgive you. And then we got the doubt and love in reverse. Child. Man, Knight of Cups in reverse. It's this doubt. I release the need to know all the answers. Is that you, man? Like, I don't know what you could possibly beat me out for. You just ate. Somebody doubts that it's love or somebody hates the fact that somebody doubts them. Hmm. Your temperance to the page of wands. So you have an earth angel that may be speaking some type of truth. I don't know what they got to do with any of this, but. Mm. Mm, okay, let's see. Yeah, somebody's blocking somebody out because they know that they don't have no love for them. Yeah, this may be a group of friends that you may have carried a lot of burdens for, that you may have um, taken care of or put them in a position where they could take care of themselves. But somebody realizing that, um, yeah, they didn't give a fuck. And you got three of pentacles to the doubt. So it's a group of people that um, don't believe fat meat greasy. <laughs> Oh shit. They don't I feel like they don't believe in someone's power. I don't know why I'm getting that. Then we got the four of wands to the five of pentacles. Yeah. They doubting some shit, but they gonna learn. <laughs> they gonna go from their nice big pretty mansions to their nice, you know, home lives, you know, shit stable to five of pentacles in this small fucker. Keep having this doubt. Keep thinking it's sweet. Yeah. And I'm seeing these arches. It looks like a church. I'm going to give y'all a break today. I ain't going to go in on y'all today. I'm going to let y'all have it. Because shit. I see what it's going to be. It's on this failure. Queen of Swords in reverse. You're a failure, ma'am. Whatever you try to do. all the, This Queen of Swords in reverse, child. <sighs> This is somebody that does not nurture. This is somebody, listen to the damn temperance in reverse. This is your, your attitude and your, your temperament and your mindset is the reason that you are a failure. It's the reason that you um can't achieve things. This queen of swords in reverse, it's like everything that come out of your mouth is like negativity. Spirit is calling for someone else to stand in their power and forgive the people that tried to seven the sword you. I can't even, they, look, they don't even want me to pick the damn cards up. <laughs> Listen, 
Yes, yeah, Spirit says, stand in your power. You can forgive the people. You can give them forgiveness, absolutely, as you should, because if not, then this, this um, energy stays in, in your body. It literally um, stays in your system and festers and causes dis-ease in your body. So somebody needs to stand in their power and forgive somebody for this seven of swords. You ain't got to let them back in your energy, but you you have to get, get to a place of forgiveness for that. Yeah, in order to receive your abundance, you got to clear that way. Oh, and your abundance is a queen of cups. Yeah, you definitely got to get that off your heart. Give me something on this. Um, <laughs> Listen, three of swords, heartbroken. I'm telling you, this group of people over here think it's sweet. Yeah, three of swords around here. Okay. Whoever you are that has put blocked um, friends and pulled back and gave them back their burdens because you feel like it's no love. I feel like you are manifesting the type of love that you want. And you're letting your spirit guide you. You're letting your ancestors guide you. You may have children that you may take along. Maybe a teenager and maybe a smaller child. Give me something on this failure. Damn. And listen, four cups, missed opportunity. Somebody that's soaking, this is somebody that is mad. But the Spirit wants you to understand that this is a lesson in humility. Mm. Listen, ancestors coming through. This is, oh shit. This is a, <laughs> damn. <laughs> this is a lesson in humility. See, because the problem with most people is they feel like they're going to always be where they're at. And I feel like this Queen of Swords is upset and feels like a failure because she see herself moving down the chain. So now she feels like she's missed an opportunity. And then also light has been shined on your sexual life. Oh, shit. What the fuck? She done done. Damn. So you might have had a... <laughs> this is... <laughs> Am I supposed to say that? <laughs> oh, shit. 2244 on the clock. Am I supposed to say that, Spirit? Oh, God. So you're really known for um sleeping around, but everybody feels like your sex is trash. But you do it for a lot of money, and this is the tower that's blowing in your life because people are... um. Her bad reputation. So that's a part of your karma is to be, um, damn, for real spirit, humiliated publicly because you may have done this to someone. Mm, give me something on this. Shit. I couldn't even say what I wanted. Yeah, somebody, queen of wands in reverse. Somebody needs to forgive a hoe. <laughs> I mean, because, but if she, and this is where the delusion be coming in for people. First of all, she young as shit with this king of swords. She's young as fuck. This is childish energy. And you mad, and you, you, I don't see that you're mad, but you need to forgive somebody for this. And it's like, you mad because somebody did this to you. But she a hoe. That's what hoes do. Hoes are sneaky. Hoes is deceitful. Hoes trying to get that bag, no matter how they get that bag. So it's like, I don't know what this hoe did to you, but you got to accept a little bit of responsibility for thinking that a hoe wasn't going to do this. That's, I mean, that's just what it is. I mean, respectfully, that's just what it is. Somebody had high hopes in the hole. <laughs> Spirit, y'all gotta stop. I told y'all they be thinking this shit. <laughs> this shit is me. Oh my God, y'all be thinking they be thinking this shit is me. You, um, shit. 
I think I feel like shit. But this, we can about close out on this one. We got this person over here that needs to forgive the prostitute and take a little bit of responsibility for thinking that she wasn't gonna snake you. That's what they do. We got somebody over here that's an epic failure, whose sex life is gonna be like is <laughs> damn. Yeah, yeah. Everybody talking about how trash your shit is. And with this star card, you did this with a lot of people. You were very popular for this. Damn. Somebody was popular for fucking. That's somebody was popular for fucking was okay. So that's this chick over here. Okay, so this the hoe. Okay, so this is the failure. Got it. And then you got this group of men over here who whole shit finna come tumbling down. Cause they doubted some shit and they did some stuff that they thought was sweet. And now they see and it ain't sweet with the five of pentacles to the motherfucking three of swords anguish not only mentally psychologically yes mm -hmm. shit to the justice i can't make it up these men might be going to jail they might be facing court they might be what this four of wands is. They might listen and they mad as fuck. But what you mad for? Mm hmm. Consequences. 26, 26 on the clock. Consequences. But we got this beautiful energy over here, though. Well, let's see. Give me something on this spirit. Somebody didn't let what they went through a bad experience. And a love connection detoured them from not wanting love in their life. Oh, I like that. The lovers to the magician. To the six of swords. And listen, I just seen that ace of swords. Spirit said, that's true. And the ace of cups, baby. She can't. Listen, I can't even make it up. To the ace of cups. Somebody didn't let what they went through. Listen, the nine of... Nine of Wands in reverse. Somebody didn't let what they went through detour them from actually wanting to connect with somebody. Mm. Shit, this bitch. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody mama. Okay, whatever. Um, whoever you are that um needs to forgive this Queen of Wands, there's also a Queen of Pentacles that you stop giving to. This may be your mother, or this may be her mother. The chariot is sideways fill out with this woman. What is what does that mean, spirit? That's this woman that's trying to act like she wasn't in on a bribe to get somebody locked up. The spirit said that's true. Yeah, she was trying to have somebody else in the sunken place, but that shit didn't work. It backfired on her, and she's confused at how somebody still was able to walk away. Mm, okay, we're going to stop right there because I ain't even trying to give it all that we done recapped all these little miss um high pocket over here got problems and situations she finna be put on blast if she ain't there listen i can't even make it up she finna be put on blast about what for sex life mm-hmm about what her being an all-star hoe <laughs> Shit, an all-star hoe that wasn't that great. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I cannot. We we finna pull right on up out of that spirit. Congratulations to this person that came out of this, a loveless situation with all this love still in their heart. Indeed, indeed. And that's how you checkmate the game. When people do shit to break you, the worst you can, thing you can do is let it break you. Because they win. Shit, you brush that shit off your motherfucking shoulders and keep moving. They, they don't know how to take that. 
That make them even more mad. <laughs> like, I did all this shit to this motherfucker and they still happy? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We still happy. <laughs> Indeed. Sure. Y'all seen that change in reverse? Spirit said, don't let it change you. Man, because some shit happened to you and it just changed you. It changes the trajectory of your life. And sometimes it's for the good and sometimes it's for the worse. That's the thing you need to identify. That's the thing that you need to heal. You need to go back to a time and figure like, who would I have been if X, Y, and Z hadn't happened? Hmm. That's a beautiful place to start. Okay, yeah, love in the upright that tried to come out, so we're gonna take it. We always take some love, <laughs> and we're gonna take some gratitude too. Indeed, <laughs> the two highest vibrations on this planet. Listen, I feel like this look like an eye like, open your eyes and be grateful, show gratitude for the things in your life, and then you got the, the, the red, the heart. I don't know why that makes me feel like. And open your heart. Show gratitude and open your heart. This shit ain't rocket science. It ain't rocket science. Commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. And then when you recognize that it ain't good, I can't even make it up that damn. You got somebody that refuses to surrender to change. Somebody stuck in their ways. No. All right. God, somebody refuses to surrender to change, but if they do surrender to the change, they're going to step right into their purpose. Somebody's just kind of feeling around in the dark when it comes to their purpose. A lot of times men think their purpose is to just make all the money that they can because that's what's in your spirit is to provide. Um. But sometimes it ain't shit. 99% of the time, it ain't even about that. Is this your mindset changing? Do you still have the same mentality that you had 10 years ago, 15 years ago? Are you feeding and nourishing your spirit? Are you feeding and nourishing your mind? Are you mindful of the words that you speak? Are you mindful of the moves that you make? Man, it's a lot that goes into growing. It ain't just your pockets. Mm. Somebody love gonna be explosive. And listen, I feel like I wanna take those two. Oh shit, to the Empress. We gonna take that. Mighty Oshun energy out here. <laughs> Mighty Oshun energy out here. That's what powerful. Yeah, when you come across an energy like this, it blows your mind. Listen and open it. I can't even make it up. I said what I said. That heart chakra overflowing. This is beautiful energy. This is somebody that changes the atmosphere when they step into a room. Even if they don't. That, listen, I'm telling you, they bring happiness. What? <laughs> oh, shit to the higher fat. Mm. Somebody has a carefree spirit. I just seen that fool card. Somebody has a carefree spirit. And it's noticeable even when this person don't feel like it's noticeable. This is like, a, I'm just going to run to the gas station right fast. You know, I ain't finna get like fully dressed. Mm. Shit. Somebody... Uh, Okay. Hold on. I'm okay. Let me go over there. My spirit said that's true. Shit. Okay. <laughs> that threw me off. Shit. I wasn't expecting that to go there. But for the gratitude, we got the hermit. Somebody may be in hermit mode. Somebody may be becoming an enlightened. And they're realizing that they have a lot more things in their life to be grateful for than they may have previously believed. Um, they may be letting go. I can't even make it up. Some toxic energy or toxic traits. 
maybe my nose itching somebody tapping in somebody is tapping in they say you want to attract more things you have to start by being grateful for the things that you have you know some people get things and they get cocky and spirit will strip you of that shit asap oh really oh you didn't use that to do good oh you didn't use that to you know help nobody you didn't use that to make this place better you didn't use that okay cool let me show you what I can do. Listen, I just seen that damn sun card exposed. Or happiness. We're going to take happiness because we on a good vibe today. With this surrender in reverse, child, somebody may uh, refuse to turn themselves in. Somebody refuses to turn themselves in. Either somebody refuses to turn themselves in or somebody refuses to... um release their mind and their fears and their anxiety somebody is maybe stuck mentally the spirit said that's true somebody's not working on like their issues somebody's not working on their issues or somebody feel like they ain't turning themselves to the fucking and shit <laughs> but i feel like this might be mentally though Shit. Okay, so somebody was trying to get somebody to not surrender and keep them in the Eight of Swords all up in their minds. But with this Ace of Swords, this person receives some type of clarity, some type of truth where whatever manipulation that somebody tried mentally didn't work. Okay. <laughs> oh shit what you got somebody here what in the fuck you got somebody here <laughs> this shit crazy to you that wants to take a risk towards someone to have sex with them the hey man in reverse they don't want to be in a connection but they want to be in a home with somebody but they want to be able to have their options open but they don't want that person to be able to go nowhere and have their options what the fuck why would they think that some shit like that will work spirit i mean just look at what it says it's like they want to come in and be carefree and just have sex with somebody but they want to be in a home with somebody but they want to be able to have their options open but they don't want nobody else to what the fuck? yeah with the hey man in reverse they don't want to be tied down this fucking queen of wands in reverse. Okay, you know what? This bitch, so a spirit is calling for somebody to make some changes in their life and step into their purpose if you're dealing with this type of foolishness because this is just pure D foolishness on the table right here. Yeah, this queen of wands, spirit said block this woman out because she really just there for your money. And that should be obvious with this. I, I, I guess this is supposed to be some type of deal. Spirit said change and step into your purpose when you change from whatever this is because this is crazy this is crazy i'm gonna read it again just in case maybe it's just me so you got somebody that wants to take a risk well takes a lot of risk sexually Shit, takes a lot of risk sexually don't want to be tied down to nobody but she want a motherfucker to put her ass up in a nice pretty big shiny home but yet she still want to have her options open but she don't want this person to move forward yeah what you know what i'm not even gonna speak on that 
Because that's just pure D foolishness right there. That's pure D foolishness right there. That's what you call this eight of swords. Oh, that's what this eight of swords is. That's why this motherfucker confused. Well, was confused. My nose itching. So that's why this person was confused because this because this is confusing. So this is what somebody did to somebody. She turned them out with some sex. Then made him feel like she didn't want to be in a connection with just him. But yet somehow they got to a point where they actually shared a home together. But she still kept her options open. But she don't want this person to move forward towards somebody else. Try well, listen. Give me something on this good energy over here, Spirit. We ain't got time for that foolishness over there. We, we ain't got time for it. Give me something on this love, Spirit. Because that is just pure D foolishness right there. Mm. That shit crazy. Yeah, somebody is in her mode. They're going, they they showing gratitude because they don't want to feel like they're gonna miss an opportunity. Yeah. Seven of Wands. This empress is protected. And whoever this person is in hermit mode, you receive justice when you pull back from a connection. Yeah, you brought that shit to a complete halt. That may have been with this energy over here is what you should have did because this is pure D foolishness on the table. Yeah, nay in the fucking five of cups as they should be. As they should be. Because that, that, yeah. Spirit is saying, make some changes in your life. And when you do, when you step away from this energy, you're going to step right into your purpose. And I don't know why I want to feel like this hierophant energy, that's your purpose. Whoever this is in hermit mode that is showing gratitude and that is actually working on exercising your demons and you cutting off negative energies and you are stepping into this hierophant energy, that is your purpose. That's what this seven of wands is. Your purpose is to protect this empress. Yep. And when and in protecting this empress, you're going to find the love of your life with the ten of cups to the ace of cups. It's going to be mind blowing. The contrast between these two women. Because this is a queen of wands in reverse. This is a hot pocket right here. And she proved that she was a hot pocket with this foolishness going on over here. You want to keep them as she want this, this. You know what? This is, <laughs> oh shit, this spirit. And and I'm not trying to be disrespectful to nobody, but this is like a kept man. You know, like in back in the day, they would have the kept woman, like usually the Creole women, women like me, like they would have them like put away and they would, you know, take care of all their needs and shit. It's like, I don't, this man is, this, in, this woman is crazy. She is operating like a masculine. Damn, she is. She is operating in her masculine energy, but it's fucked people up because she is out here. Because with the Queen of Wands, you know, she look good when she go to the club. Spirit said she ain't washing that ass when she at home, though. She good when she go to the club, 43, 43 on the clock. She good when she go to the club. So she make it look good as fuck. But this woman operates in masculine energy. Because usually the men are the one that sleep around. The men are the one that want to put the woman away in the house and, you know, take care of the shit and then still be out having their options. Usually that's a, like um, toxic masculine, masculine energy. And that's what this Queen of Wands is walking in. She's walking in toxic max, masculine energy, even though she's a female. And this person is just like, you know, I, I'm good on that edit. I'm going to bring that shit to a complete stop. With the lovers in reverse. This person went in hurry mode like, I ain't got time for this foolishness. And then showing gratitude and and, and working to um, share toxic energies from their life. With the lovers to the devil in reverse. 
Like this person is is stepping into their gifts and stepping into their purpose as the hierophant. And then and to protect this empress. Like shit, I can't make it up. But in protecting this em empress, he's gonna be like mind blown at all the love and the happiness that he has with this person. Cause this is still fell out under the love card, the mighty old shoe. All right, I like that one. We're gonna pull up out of that one, y'all. I'm gonna do one more. Yeah, this person received some clarity because that understood this person just trying to keep them bound to that foolishness over there. There's somebody need to go about their business. Ain't nobody in their right mind gonna put up with that. Shit, and if they do put up with that, that's because they doing that shit too. Shit, that shit dangerous. In more ways than one. Right. All right, Steve, can we get the next ones, please? And thank you. Um, and whoever you are that's stepping into your purpose, you're going to love it. You're going to love what you do. You're going to love protecting this woman. You're going to be love putting a smile on this woman's face because she's going to reciprocate that to you. Baby. That's going to be a lot of laughter. A lot of joy in the connection. The higher thing to the empress, like that is two high vibrating people naturally. So they're just going to magnify each other. Okay, spirit. Next one's peace. I can't even believe little Miss High Pocket. She tripping. <laughs> she act like she, that bitch act like she was a female pimp. And that's the energy I got off that shit. Like, <laughs> oh shit. Somebody may be in grief because they're gonna be found guilty about something. Somebody's trying to make somebody doubt that what they're feeling is love. <laughs> Yeah, spirit is saying trust and don't worry about what that bitch talking about. But she don't know what she's talking about. She don't know what she's talking about. Now somebody that don't know nothing about love gonna try to tell you what ain't love. Shit. <laughs> what? what? Mm, I just seen the higher fin again. Divine masculine energy out here today. To the king of cups, I can't make it up. That don't want to let something go. Make me some breakfast before I get on this road. <sighs> Give me something on this love and doubt spirit. Yeah, the, the love is protected. This is gonna be somebody wants someone to doubt that with the connection that they're going to, into is love, but you're going into a connection with somebody that is gonna fight for you and with you, not. When I say with you, I don't mean like y'all going to argue back and forth. Like y'all going to be like a team against other people. Mm. You may have been the type of person that never had nobody that you had people that was always trying to defeat you. People that you showed love to was always trying to defeat you. This ain't going to be that. It's not going to be no competition in this um in this connection. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. with this doubt we got the king of swords in reverse you can't listen to no liar this is a man that lies all the time this is the person that gives you the lies that you don't ask for like they literally <laughs> we oh god i had this man that worked like that every time somebody says something he had a story that was great of or he might look my nose and just, <laughs> just lie for no reason. And this is the person that's trying to place doubt in your mind. 
He's a liar. Don't pay him no mind. Spirit says, don't, why, why, just why? I'm two seconds from not having a dog, y'all. I promise I am. I promise I am. I can get like three racks for your ass. So with the trust and worry in reverse, Spirit says you're going to defeat people when you take a risk and take a love offer to a queen of cups. That's going to be your justice. Mm-hmm. That's going to be, this is what's going to defeat all these naysayers. It's going to defeat all your naysayers. I didn't even want to use this. Thing. Okay. Listen to the death card to the ace of wands. I'm telling you. <laughs> they're going to know it too. Listen, I can't even, I'm telling you, it's going to put an end to all of the bull, all of the doubt. It's going to put an end to it. It's going to be game over. Because y'all going to, the knowledge and the wisdom that y'all share between each other is going to be powerful. Wait a minute. Let me make sure somebody ain't trying to kill the Queen of Cups first. <laughs> oh, shit. Y'all might be trying to click. Listen, the moon in reverse. So y'all might be trying to kill the Queen of Cups. Wait a minute. Because of the knowledge that she has? <laughs> Exposed. You will not be victorious. The only thing you're going to get out of that shit, nine of swords. This is going to be you. If it ain't you already. Confirmation. Go sit your sit down, Foxy, please. We ain't gonna stay in that little retarded energy too long. That's special. So somebody trying to pretend like they want to come in and take <laughs> oh shit. So they feel like somebody can defeat this Queen of Cups by going in and pretending to be like they want to take a risk with them with this Knight of Cups and show them and sweep them off their feet only so they can kill them because they think that if they kill this woman, they're going to acquire the knowledge that she has. But with this moon in reverse, um, yeah, that's not going to happen. Page of Wands, this is me discussing this. Y'all better go sit the fuck down. Yeah, y'all trying to figure out how y'all can... Why did it... Listen, I can't even make it the fuck up. Listen, y'all gonna learn. Y'all gonna, I'm, I'm gonna learn you today. I'm gonna learn you today. Listen. Somebody may be sitting back and discussing how they can get next to a person sexually or how they can, um, oh shit, what? <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> the hell we done stumbled upon? Am I saying this shit right here? So somebody may have been talking about how great somebody's sex was with the page of wands to the knight of wands to the um tower. I feel like somebody may have talked to somebody's ex and they told them that the sex was bomb. The hell is this? And this person may have went and looked for themselves, but when they did, they fell in love with the person because they found out that they were starved a star seed or that they shine bright the hell i know that is that a side note spirit because i know that ain't got nothing to do with this or does it that's what somebody wants this queen of cups to think okay i see you motherfuckers and i can't even make it up to the moon in reverse again I'm telling you to the death card in reverse okay so this is somebody trying to do spell work this is somebody trying to um 
Make this Queen of Cups believe that somebody's coming in to try to get next to her just so they could kill her. But that ain't even the case. Because, it, listen, it's not the case. It's manipulation. That's why this trust and don't worry came out. Because fear is saying that somebody is on some bull. They feel like this. They tried to make it seem like this Queen of Cups has some knowledge that they didn't want to expose. But with the moon to the damn moon, I can't make the shit up. The moon to the moon, you've been exposed. Somebody is trying to get somebody to believe this. And it didn't work with the with the damn... Okay. <laughs> These motherfuckers retarded, man. This is all you getting, man. I'm sorry, y'all, the sun is Venus. This is all you getting. Sleepless nights and no victory. Somebody's ancestors is calling for them to trust. Or somebody may got somebody thinking that this Queen of Cups is going to try to kill them because they know something about what they did in the dark. That's manipulation as well. I can't make up the moon to the moon in reverse. Somebody is being exposed. Listen, the fucking five of wands. Somebody's pissed off. Somebody's mad as fuck because I'm right on point. Somebody's trying to get somebody to believe this. That this queen of cups is going to um, try to kill the person because it's something that she knows. Wanted to have somebody in the nine of swords, but with the nine of swords in reverse, baby, that's not happening. It's going to be wish fulfillment. Hmm. That shit went left as fuck. The hell? Give me something else on this spirit. Just seen that ten of cups. Yeah, somebody trying to play some little mind games right here, y'all. They trying hard. Listen, ten of swords in reverse. That shit not working. <laughs> That's a listen. Five of cups. You sad as a motherfucker, yo. You sad because you thought somebody was gonna believe this. Yeah, that shit is in the reverse, boo. That shit ain't gonna work. Hmm. Okay. Give me something on this love spirit. I, look, the love, polar love that got lost in the foolishness. They telling somebody that if they take, they're going to be defeated if they take this risk and go towards this Queen of Cups with a love offer it's because she's going to try to sabotage them or maybe even try to kill them because she has some knowledge about something that they did in the dark, but that is just manipulation. That is just somebody trying to manipulate someone into this Nine of Swords energy, but that shit didn't work. Listen, they got, they got returned to Cinder. And now somebody mad than a motherfucker because they shit didn't work. Listen, I can't, listen, God is protecting this union. I can't even make it up to, listen, seven of wands to the seven of wands to the higher thing. This love energy over here is protected. They not concerned about nobody doing nothing to them. No, it's Queen of Wands in reverse and High Priestess in reverse. Can't make up the Seven of Wands to the Seven of Wands. Give me something. This King of Swords off of quiet over here. Let me get something on him. <laughs> okay. The person that's trying to place doubt in someone's mind is fucking whoever you thought was your woman. Damn. You got an emperor in reverse, too, that's trying to create some doubt. Damn, and a queen of swords in reverse. Damn, yeah, they doing a whole lot of talking. Somebody got about four motherfucking bugaboos in their ear, like dead ass bringing conflict and drama with this five of wands. Somebody... <laughs> I feel sorry for you, yo. This is like anytime whoever they answer the fucking phone with, whoever they speak to, it's somebody that's throwing more salt than the rice of the wind. 
Yeah, they talking amongst each other about how you ain't been on the scene. Ain't nobody seen you. You're not hanging out with your friends no more. You kind you um want to go into a connection. They talking about this shit amongst each other. This may be a woman that you sleep with. This may be the mother of your children or a sister. This may be a brother. And this may be like a father or a grandfather or like a father figure with this emperor in reverse. But this motherfucker is, yeah, he, the emperor in reverse. This is an abusive authority. Somebody that feels like they got the right to tell somebody what they're supposed to be doing. But um, in actuality, it's none of their damn business. Give me something else on this spirit. There's a lot of people to the king of pentacles. Man, you the only one in the upright, man. King of Pentacles, you're the only one in the upright. They ain't going to defeat you, though. Stand in your power. You are standing in your power. Yep, I see you. You the King of Swords in the upright while this nigga is in the reverse. You make, you setting boundaries with all these people. Shit, you got the five. I, look, they was trying to defeat you. They was trying to defeat you. With the five of swords the five of swords they was trying to make you believe that someone was going to sabotage you when they was the ones but you defeated them with this five of swords in reverse four swords in reverse they couldn't lay you to rest listen i can't make it up ten of swords they couldn't lay you to rest why because you were standing in your shit protecting your empress listen protecting your your what your happiness protecting what your sunshine i can't make it up this is where this double protection come from for this empress. This is the same from the last time. This empress is divinely protected, not only by God, but also by this king of swords. I feel like this king of swords, higher fit energy is the same energy from before. That man ain't playing. Yeah, you got a group of people that's going to lose a nice hefty bag. They finna get 10 wands around this bitch. Uh, while they get a fresh new start. Hmm. There it is. This person was doing mind manipulation over here. They was doing spell work. They were trying to get somebody to believe that this Queen of Cups wanted to kill them or wanted to take them out in some type of way. Mm -mm. That was not the case. The moon to the moon. This is double exposure. This is double exposure. That moon wanted to switch in the upright too. One of the moons um, flipped in the upright. That means that somebody is still trying to do this whole mental play like to try to just keep somebody mind going round and round round and round round and round where the spirit said don't worry about that spirit says trust trust that this connection that you're fighting for this connection that you're standing 10 toes down for you're gonna get 10 cups for them 10 toes that you holding down you're gonna get 10 cups for them 10 toes that you're standing on about this empress and the love that you feel for her and you got god behind you and you are divinely protected. Times two. Because you got her spiritual protection. And then you got a spirit team too. That ain't playing. I'm going to get up out of here on that one, y'all. I'm going to get up out of here on that one. Stop listening to this nigga. Like somebody, somebody need to just put their phone in airplane mode around this bitch. Because every person that's trying to give you this doubt. It's about four or five people that's trying to make somebody doubt something that is actually a true love connection. And you've been watching this person and you see this person shine. You see this person is full of love. And you also, yeah, curious about the sex. Somebody done told you that somebody's sex is fire. <laughs> oh, shit. Somebody talking, somebody pillow talking. <laughs> <laughs> but at least they kept it a thou wow. At least about that. Spirit said they might have lied about a couple of other things, but we ain't gonna trip. You know, I was raised on the G code. So I'm a, you know, do exactly that. When it comes to rumors that people spread about me or what somebody say about me. I don't give a fuck enough to clear up any rumors. 
I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Shit. Whether it's true or not, I don't give a damn. All right, y'all. I'm finna get up out of here. I gotta go make me some food right fast before I get on this road. Everybody have an awesome day. And we'll get back on later on tonight. And um, everybody have a great one. Gratitude and love, the two highest vibrations. Come on up here. <laughs> come up here. They can't come up here. <laughs>